those who fish on Lake Mille Lacs every day will tell you. There's big fish, there's fish of all sizes. There's more walleyes in the lake right now than I've seen in a long, long time. The lake is full of fish, and that includes walleyes. We just caught a 27 and a half inch uh, four hours ago. The only problem is you can't keep any of the walleyes. This is the third summer of catch and release, mandated by the DNR in an effort to increase the walleye numbers on the lake. Except for members of the eight bands of the Lake Superior Chippewa Indians, they're allowed to net walleye. And now this photo is being shared across social media by people upset with walleye management on the lake. It shows an abandoned tribal gill net with 67 dead walleye weighing 112 pounds. The people are upset. Doug Meyenberg leads PERM, a group opposed to tribal netting. He believes the netting hurts the walleye population because it's done during the spring spawning period, affecting breeding. The DNR disputes that theory. Nonetheless, Meyenberg argues the lake's co-management doesn't work and wants others to see the wastefulness shown here. You had 66 fish that went in a garbage dumpster somewhere. A tribal spokesman told the St. Paul Pioneer Press they're investigating and the wasted fish will count against the Fond du Lac band's walleye quota for the year. It counted towards the, uh, the band's tally and that's really all you can ever ask for. Right now the DNR is studying the number of walleye in Lake Mille Lacs They'll have the results later this summer, and that will affect next year's fishing rules. On Lake Mille Lacs, Lou Raguse, CARE 11 News.